and the Endangered Wildlife Trust within the Wildlife in Trade program. We train dogs in tracking and detection work as part of our efforts to address poaching and the illicit smuggling of wildlife products. Right now, we have 15 canines working for us, based here at our headquarters and strategic reserves throughout South Africa. On a given day, one of our canines and the handler will screen dozens of vehicles or check cargo or follow tracks of suspicious persons. They detect wildlife products or ammo hidden behind layers of plastic in the hubcups of cars, through boxes and suitcases. They can be trained to detect a wide variety of wildlife products, from rhino horn to pangolin scales to elephant ivory to lion bones to firearms, ammunition and poison. In the Wildlife and Trade program, we work to mitigate the trade-related threats to fauna and flora. Our conservation canines are hugely instrumental in this. We plan to expand this project with additional dogs and handlers and get into more reserves. The canine and handler operate as a unified team. The handler takes care of the canine's everyday needs and welfare is high priority. I knew I wanted to be a dog handler back in 2016 when I was working for one of the protected areas in the Limpopo. So I was amongst one of the, all of the other rangers who put up their hands wanting to be a, a, a canine handler. So I think a word that sums it all up for me is passion. I, I love dogs and this is what I want to do. I really want to follow my heart's uh, desire in becoming a canine handler. So I'm innocent, uh, I'm and I work for the Endangered Wildlife Trust.